Good day, everyone. It is an honor to be able to present our innovation research result to you today. First of all, allow me to introduce myself. My name is Shalita Nafisah, and I will be presenting to you on behalf of my team the result of our innovation research titled Synthesis of MUF HCAS1 with additional ZIP8 as an absorbent for Gongor phase. The team for this research consists of four, those are all final year chemistry students at Institut Teknologi 10 November, Indonesia. The United Nations has made sustainable consumption and production alongside with the availability and sustainable management of water, a global goal. One industrial action that can very much help achieve this goal is to control industrial affluence containing toxic chemicals that sadly are normally released into water sources. Textile industry is one of the biggest industry in this world today, and one of the most common chemical use in the industry of textile is textile dye. Gongoret dye is one of the most common used dye because of its characteristic that can effectively stick into fabric material, does not fade quickly, and give a vivid color. Gongoret dye is easily soluble in water, making it hard to remove as a waste. It is also difficult to degrade naturally, causing it to stay in water for a long time. Congoret is very toxic to human and the entire water environment. Given the situation, proper strategy and action is needed to control this congoret dye waste. In the study, the absorption method was chosen for the congoret waste management process. For this method to achieve its full potential, the absorbent material used has to have a high absorption capacity. That is why we carefully chose four materials to be the following. HCAS1 is a metal organic framework or MUF with a high surface area and pore regularity, resulting in HCAS1 being a very selective absorbent. In our study, we used ZIF8 to make a binary MUF material that is suitable for an effective absorbent. ZIF8 is also another MUF material known to have exceptional absorption characteristic. ZIF8 stands out as a material because of its easy production, high surface area, great thermal stability, and its pH in this biodegradability. Here are the documentation of the resulted material. The composite material was declared to be successfully synthesized because there was no drastic change due to addition of ZIF-8 material into HCOS-1. Based on the FTIR characterization, it is known that the synthesized composite material gives rise to the typical absorption bands of HCOS-1 and ZIF-8, namely, with numbers around 728, which are identified as vibration of copper and oxygen bond belonging to HCAS1, and in wave number around 414, detected vibration of zinc and nitrogen belonging to ZIF-8. Based on the results of some characterization, ZIF-8 was detected scattered on the surface of HCAS1 as a result of the synthesis method used, causing the surface to appear rougher. The surface area itself shows a decrease in surface area after the addition of ZIF-8. The synthesized material is classified as having micropores based on u -pack. The absorption test with the effect of contact time was carried out to determine the optimum time. The optimum contact time was found at 16 minutes, with the largest absorption capacity, with almost 100% of removal percentage. The ZIF-8 H plus 1 composite, therefore, can be a good candidate for industrial waste management because the value of our innovation product is the unique combination of the two MOFs themselves, making the composite a new, effective, and efficient absorbent material with very high removal percentage improvement when compared to pure MOF. The visualization of future for the product is to be commercialized in the form of compacted powder to facilitate the mobilization of the absorbent before application. When applied to the dye waste, the absorbent will then dissolve into the dye waste and begin to absorb the dye waste. The conclusion is that this ZIF-8 H plus 1 composite has been successfully synthesized using the in-situ method, and that the material showed the most optimal result with a maximum absorption capacity value of 49.067 mg per gram and 98% removal. Therefore, this absorbent has the potential to be applied in industry. That is all from us. Once again, we are very grateful to be given the opportunity to present the result of our innovation research 
and thank you so much for your time and your attention.